Hello everyone, um, we are again here live in Shanghai for another interview. Remo is at the moment busy for the grand final, so I will jump in for him, I hope you don't mind. And I have a special guest today, it's Wu Shuyen. Yes, it's my Sorry English for name. Uh, you guys can call me Alexa, it's my English name, or my ID Snokis. So hello yeah. everyone. It's Snokis. Snokis casts the final, or a part of it, mm -hmm. for the Chinese audience. And yeah, I'm pretty excited to get to know her a bit better and what uh, she does uh, for a living. So, Elisha? Elisa. Elisa. Yes, you're right. Um, what is your current job in the esports scene? Alright, actually I'm a caster and commentator. I started my esports thing like maybe 10 years ago. I was a whole path free on pro gamer and the caster. But nowadays I'm just doing Hearthstone caster and commentating in China for Blizzard. So I'm a huge Blizzard nut. Alright, that raises a lot of questions. Yes. <laughs> Tell us a bit about your past. Um, uh, your English is pretty nice. It mm -hmm. sounds like a native speaker. Um, but you were born in China. Yeah. I was born in China and all my family migrated to Australia when I was 10. So pretty much I'm Chinese and native Chinese speaker and brought up in Australia. So I speak both Chinese and um, English as well. Um, I was graduated in Hong Kong and then moved back to Shanghai, started my esports career when I was 21, I believe. So I started in SITV for a caster, like a host for World Pass Ray. And then moved on to Dota, but now I'm doing Hearthstone. Well, what uh, led to the decision to start? A career in esports um, back in that day. Just simply because I love to play the game. Yeah. It's really, really simple. I love to watch the game, I love to play. It's my everything for my um, college life. That's why I decided I'm going to do it. Yes, I love esports. Wow. Uh, how did you get in touch with Warcraft for the first time? And what makes it your favorite game or one of your favorite games? Um, just mentioned I love to play the games because I meet a lot of friends who also play Warcraft and get to know the clan. I told them I love, I'm so passionate about the game because they told me, well, um, the lack of female casters, if, if you would like to try, I'll, I'll offer you a chance. I was like, oh man, it sounds very nice to me. And then I just started, boom, bingo, I got a job in. I feel really lucky during that time because I never thought I can get a job so easy for the for esports thing. That's, just that's, about stuff. that's really awesome. Yeah. Um, let's talk a bit about uh, women in esports, mm -hmm. but I just want to know, do you think women should uh, compete in separate competitions? Mm -hmm. Or is esports the sport where just women and men can compete on the same level with the same amount of training? What do you think? How do, uh, would you handle that? Actually, to be very honest to you guys, depends on the game. For RTS game and mobile game, I think yes, because I've tried a hard, like many times, 10 hours a day practice for Warcraft 3, but there's no way I can beat the male players at all. But for like Hearthstone, this kind of card game, probably not. It's not that hard compared to RTS game, but for RTS and mobile game, that's definitely yes. Nice, that would be really awesome to see because I think that's. Uh one unique spot here that esports has, like connect women and men in, in competition. Yeah. Um, but female can participate in as well, like a caster, like a host, yeah, like interviewer. Yes, yeah, it's, it's fun. Though. And uh, now the final will go on. It's mm -hmm. TH against Foggy. What is your prediction? So it varies, honest. I hope Foggy can win the champion. <laughs> well, first of all, I'm a Chinese. I just hope like TH get yeah, lucky this time and get the champion. However, I think for Warcraft thing. They need more heroes, like non-Chinese, even Korean, European, like American, anyone, but just not Chinese. It's because we want the thing go around bigger and bigger. Okay, so you kind of rooting for Foggy, but do you also think you will win? Definitely, yes, I go for Foggy. <laughs> <laughs> and Sorry, my Chinese fans, <laughs> but I'll go Foggy this time. Uh, despite from Foggy, who is your favorite player? Sweet. Sweet. A oh, very old player. Player. I yeah. love him so much. Because of him, I just to play Undead. I watch him ah, nice. every match. I just love Sweet. But oh. he's got married. Oh. 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 Sorry. I'm so sad for you. Yeah. Uh, is he still playing? Do you know what he's doing um, now? Is he's he somehow the coach for League of Legends team. He's a League of Legends coach. That's nice. So you said you're also an Undead player? I'm an Undead player. That's nice. For the <laughs> just, Lich King. So funny, like almost everyone I meet here, that is not a gamer, is an undead player. <laughs> Unfortunately, undead dominating the caster thing, but not the player. Do, you, the do play. you think so many people get involved by not playing, uh, but by doing other stuff in Warcraft, um, that are UD players because they get laid so often with tanks? 
the day is out. Oh, it's <laughs> I don't want to answer that, but maybe... I, I've become a caster. Uh, maybe, yes, yeah. But, like, undead big casters very often, like, in China. Chowling's undead, like, tennis sure. undead, shoes undead. Yeah, I'm undead, undead. everybody's undead, but needle? we're just a caster. Oh, <laughs> come on. So, yeah, um, you will cast the final now, too? I'm going to cast the final, because the best of seven, so we're going to rotate. So, three match they're going to pass, and the major three match I'm going to cast. So I wish you good luck for that, and uh, I guess we all hope for awesome games. And Go foggy. Thanks a lot for the interview, it was really nice uh, to get to know you better, and to get some background information. Thank you guys for and watching, and I hope you guys to support the Warcraft thing forever, because we're going to talk about it. It's the best game. It's the best game. Thank you guys. It's a nice word. See you guys.